Okay, getting near the end here, and this is where we evaluate the essay as a whole, or, or not we, the author evaluates uh, Ryan's essay. And this is helpful to the reader because, you know, even even a, an article that has a couple of claims, it can get confusing. So, um, you'll note that in the first sentence, so he talks about the tension. And yes, high standards are perfectly allowed by this San Francisco ballet, but in intense preparation, not so good. So those are the two claims that are made and that the author of the critique discusses. A lot of expressions like this. On the one hand, okay, she argues persuasively for standards for, for admission. This author agrees with that. And this is what they do. And we even, we cheer on performers like Tiger Woods and Michelle Kwan, who did, the, who entered the same star system. And then we got on the other hand. There's always on the other hand. This author of the critique does not like what parents do to their kids in these professional training focus with this single-minded focus. And reminds us of the horror story of Macaulay Culkin and others like them who don't have childhoods anymore because of what their mothers and fathers did. And the great thing this author does, it goes even further out, reflects a larger tension. You know, remember at the beginning, the funnel was from general to specific. Now the funnel has changed from specific to the general. Specific to the general. And this part right here is the general part. And so what this, what this author is criticizing is Ryan's belief that uh, the star system is a good thing. Or at least there's not a whole lot we can do about it. Um, although society could have a safety net for this. And see, Ryan does say there needs to be a safety net. I, I, I'm a little confusing here because I'm going back and forth between the critique author and Ryan. So Ryan says that, that we should have safety nets for these kids and that society should provide them and government agencies should, should provide them. This author says... Um, in the next section, something quite different.